Hi, my name is Patrick and this particular video is to tell you about what is the score versus percentile for a DILR section. To give you a fair idea as to what is the score you may require or how many you need to solve to get a desired percentile. Again, it may change based on the different level of the paper. We will see that I mean, if you are just looking at a 90 percentile, I mean it varies from around 15, 16 to 21 score. If you look at this, I mean 80 percentile, it varies from 11 to 16 score. I mean, since last year, if you look at every set had five questions, I mean, that also keeps changing. But last year, since every set had five questions, so if you had solved one complete set correct, you would have got a 15 mark, which would have got you around 90 percent. Right. But yes, that could change based on different level. The paper is easy. Maybe a 90 percent could be what marks required to be more than 21 or it could be less than 16 as well. I mean, we don't know as per difficult level. Although there is scaling that happens, I mean, in your story, the paper is tough, then you may require lesser marks to score the same percentile. But if in your story, the paper is easy, you may require a higher marks to score the same percentile. So it depends on that too, to some extent. But yes, you just will give you a fair idea as to what is the range of marks. I mean, if you solve two complete sets and you get it all correct, which means around 30 marks, you would most likely cross around 97 percentile, maybe even for a 99 percentile plus. I mean, that depends on the toughness of the people, right? So this gives you a fair idea to understand and target your percentile. As I said earlier, 90 percentile would clearly cut off for most colleges. Top colleges, 80 percentile is what is normally required for most top colleges. 50 percentile, good colleges. I mean, almost all the good colleges, if they have a section cut off, they require 50 percentile. There are colleges like MICA, you know, IAM, Rotec, IT Delhi, we don't have section cutoffs. Even if you score a 5 percentile, you will still get a call if your overall percentile clears the cutoffs. But yes, where there is cutoff, normally they have 50 percentile as the cutoffs. Now, if I look at DLR, I mean, a score of 16 to 21 would give you a 90 percentile. I mean, how do you score that? I mean, you can get last year if you had scored 5 and got 5 correct, you would have got a 90 percentile. But normally, if you look at a range, Around 6 and 6 correct, 18 marks would get you around that percentile. Or maybe around 10 attempt, 2 sets attempt and get 7 of them correct would still get 90 percentile. So it depends on how what you are targeting, how you go. If you get 2 sets fully correct, you may go about 97, 99 percentile as well. Right? So ensure that uh, you plan according to your strategy. But be flexible in terms of your approach. Understand the paper can be easier or tougher than what the paper was last year. So there could be flexibility in the marks that is required to score a desired percentile. So go with the open mind. Now my normal suggestion for DLR is take one set at a time. Go try to get one set correct first. Once you get one set correct, then go to a second set, then third. Don't go in the start itself by targeting like I'll solve all the sets, etc. A wrong approach just puts adds pressure to you, which will you know eventually ensure that you get lower marks. Right? All the best.